Hi, I'm Gary Pickard. I'm a professor of neuroscience uh, in the School of Veterinary Medicine and Biomedical Sciences here at UNL. I am co-founder of a startup company, Therius, and I have two other co-founders, Greg Smith, who's professor um, of microbiology immunology at Northwestern University Feinberg School of Medicine, and Katja Hellwein, who is professor of molecular biology in the Department of Molecular Biology and Microbiology at Tufts Medical School in Boston. So Therius is a vaccine company and we are making vaccines uh, for alpha herpes viruses. Most mammals have their own alpha herpes virus. Regardless whether you're a cow or a calf or a horse or a person, the viruses do the same thing. They infect epithelial cells, then they jump into the nervous system, they travel along nerve fibers, and they reside in your nervous system for the rest of your life. Sporadically, it can reactivate from a latent state that it sits in, in your nervous system, and then you can pass it on to somebody else. So these viruses have co-evolved with their hosts over thousands and thousands of years, so they don't want to kill you, they just want to live in you and stay there until they go on and infect somebody else. So we are making vaccines to uh, prevent infection from alpha herpes viruses. We have studies currently going on right now here in this building in calves. And so we have a, a bovine herpes virus vaccine that we've, that we've made. And we have money from the USDA to make the first non-neuroinvasive uh, bovine herpes virus vaccine. Bovine uh, herpes virus costs the cattle industry in this country, and Nebraska is a big cattle producer, over a billion dollars a year um, because of sporadic outbreaks and uh, when they get shipped on trucks to feed yards, uh, that causes uh, the latent virus to be expressed again because of that stressful situation. There is no current herpes virus vaccine. Uh, they've been, people have been trying for 60 years and been unsuccessful, but we think our approach is very novel. No one's ever done anything like this before. And so we anticipate having a herpes virus vaccine that we will market throughout the world. Uh, New Tech's been great. They've been very supportive throughout the years. And I'd like to thank New Tech and the university. I, I left out Eric Zies, our CEO. He's, he's from Lincoln. Without him, we uh, wouldn't be a viable company. We have two great uh, research scientists in our lab in Chicago, Austin Stoltz and, and Zach Nash. And of course, working with my longtime collaborator, Patty Sollers. Um, it's it's been, been lots of fun over the years. And also, I just like the fact that, that viruses aren't even alive. They're just pieces of DNA or RNA, and yet they've evolved to do these incredible things. And I just feel like it's really fun to try and understand what they're doing.